Imagine being this near. Holy. That was one sleeping giant. We have a plane, classic plane not moving. They're in the plane and the second plane not moving. How many times have you seen that? What's the science behind this one? From strange events to mysterious things caught on camera that sometimes we can't easily explain. What the f is happening? This gotta be a movie shoot or something. Like, why is everybody like paused like that? Guys, if you're new, we do content like this. Mm -mm, I'd love to have go. you around. Right Definitely now, like, subscribe. You are in for a ride. This gotta be a phenomenon, so sit right? Tight, like, press that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Yeah, subscribe, We're gonna boys. be watching some amazing and mysterious videos that will probably leave you baffled. Holy! Let's go. So there was like a shadow or like an actual thing that moved past, right? Sent to us oh by a subscriber. And oh my god. Yo, imagine having something like that in your in your house or your apartment and you just uh, are standing on top of it, but if it breaks or you fall inside, you actually I mean go down. I mean how many feet? We don't even know though. And taped by Tim R. In this video we can see an anomaly in the clouds. At first I thought this was caused by the sunset. But after analyzing this video a couple of times, I'm not sure. You can see that there is no streak of light towards the cloud, which makes me believe that this may be an independent source of light. Mm. But where is it coming from? Humanoid figure caught flying in Chile? Yeah, I've seen a clip like that a long time ago. A woman is going viral after sharing a video of a strange, alien-like creature that seems to have thousands of social media users scratching their heads. Oh the God. animal found by a TikTok user named oh Stinky Eyes Scrappy is seriously freaking out some commenters, while others are determined to discover its species name. In the TikToker's clip, which now has more than 2.7 million views, she shows the creature from several angles. It seems as though the animal is- It looks like a lizard, an octopus? But also scorpion, but also feels like, uh, I don't know, like that's kind of, that's a head, these are the arms, legs, that's the tail. I think it's probably a mutated version of the lizards or something else. Some sort of reptile, although any information beyond that is anyone's guess. But no, nah, definitely not a lizard. No, nah, no, nah, not a lizard. The lizard-like figure, which is clinging onto a rock with its lander, almost human-looking arms, also appears to have a coarse and bumpy body, as well as several long fingers. Where are his eyes? There are Here? quite a few mysterious videos out there of people who supposedly have superpowers. Have Crazy, that's Superman what I right there. would think would be similar to superhuman strength. Take this video for instance where a girl seems to pull a pencil towards her direction. The person next to her accidentally sees it. She then demonstrates the same thing with a phone. Oh my oh, god! Shit! Yo, I want the superpower, bro. I want that. Yeah, there are. If you could, right? This is probably one of the most popular question. If you actually had a superpower, what would you want? Most people would go with invisible, right? Because they want to see their crush, uh, you know, taking a shower. I mean, come on, guys. I like, come on, man. Like, sometimes you, you can have superpowers, but like, don't use it in that way. Come on, brothers. But but if I could fly, flying, and invisible, that invisibility. That's like two of the major ones, and uh, I guess this is the third one, like those things. There's another hand. CCTV video, for instance, where a man is in an underground parking lot. In this video, you can see this man lighting up the car's headlights. Yeah, that's Dumbledore in his teen year. <laughs> that's Dumbledore. He's like flicking the lights, you know, like if in Harry Potter. If these videos are real or not, I'm not too sure. Crazy guy, man. Just like doing this but and taking into up. consideration Buddhist myths and stories and many other accounts, there are supposedly out there people who can levitate and do much more. What? Hey, yo, what? Such as Arun Raikwar, a person who was known as the Indian Magnetic Man. Oh my god, and I'm Pakistani, so I understand the language. Yeah, this Bharati Munda, yeh kya kar raha hai? Yeah, yeh apni apni kaise wo koi si wali cheez hoti hai apni andar? Yeah, abhi wo I I dimag mein nahi aa raha, to abhi joke nahi kar sakta. To there could be somewhat out there people with. Yo, ye to Shakti Man nikla. Oh my god, that's a Shakti Man. Let's see the Indian Shakti Man. Shakti Man used to. 
<laughs> it's like a superhero, but Indian superhero. So I, I, that's what I'm calling him right now. Real superpowers that we have no knowledge of. Yeah, I believe this was... is the case of this Japanese man demonstrating what is called geokinesis. Crazy. In other words, an earthbender. In this video, you can see him pulling a huge rock out of the floor. Where are these people now? And blood is looking so normal after this. I have like... no idea how he could have faked this video. So if you do, please do leave a comment. Now you may think that we were the first ones to discover nanotechnology, but uh, that's not wrong. true. Wrong. 1600 yeah. years ago, a glass chalice, a cup known as the Lycurgus Cup, was created by the Romans with nanoparticles of gold and silver. The particles were grounded down until they were as small as 50 nanometers in diameter, less than one thousandth the size of a grain of table salt. The Holy. mixture of the precious metal suggests that the Romans that is insane though, just that thought alone like 1000 times less than a grain of uh, salt or table salt uh, and table salt already is just like, you know what I mean? Like one, at least one of them. Damn, that's crazy, right? And this kind of sparks another another idea in me or the, the something that I actually heard is, uh, I'm not sure if, if I can say that on YouTube though. Like, knew exactly what sadly. we were doing. The cup can be seen changing its colors. This has puzzled scientists for decades since it was acquired by a museum in the 1950s. What's most mysterious and unexplained about it all is how did they know about nanotechnology? Could this actually confirm the theory that maybe the ancient civilizations knew much more than we ever thought? They probably did. They at least they didn't know something that we didn't, right? Like they must have had the knowledge! It's a That's fact Tyler that Lopez humans haven't like. categorized all the species in this planet. There's still a lot that we don't know of. In Brazil, a family <laughs> went fishing Why? when they saw this. Why would you run like that? Ai, meu Deus. Hey, yo! Hey, yo, here! I'm not sure what it is. It could be a giant anaconda. Or it could be a geological problem in the region. Dang. Nevertheless, or it might be like no a, explanation for what was going on. Or it might be a chihuahua just swimming underwater Bruh. or something. Here no? was ever found. Talk about unexplained. In this next video, three friends are playing soccer in Mexico. Yeah, he showed that video earlier on. I so guess it would be... no one would ever imagine that this would happen next. Oh my god, that was like a Voldemort there. Just figure running. crosses them into one of the hallways. And he fell. And Being that kid fell. This is a really small creature. It doesn't look like a cat or a dog or anything yeah, else. He, uh, I, yeah, I, I am willing to believe this just because how natural his reaction was. And he's, he fell on the ground afterward as well. Because he was so much in shock, right? Like just came out of nowhere and it's that small. Mmm... I totally understand why they completely freaked out. Yeah, because of the yeah, video yeah. quality, it's hard to identify what exactly the creature was. But by their reaction, probably it's Voldemort. probably something that we've never seen before. It was Voldemort. It was Voldemort. In Russia, a group of people were very lucky enough to capture this unexplained phenomena. At first, I thought this could be a sub-sun. A phenomena that is very rare but can actually happen under certain circumstances. Two of these circumstances are not present in the video that we're watching. One of them is that the sub-sun is observed from above. The other condition is that normally the sub-sun appears directly below the sun. In this video, the sun is probably setting, it's not high above anymore. Yeah. And the people that are observing this phenomena are actually in front of it, not above it. Yeah, the video was posted as ground. an apparition of a saint. Although I do believe these things are possible, I'm not exactly sure that this is what's going on here. Leave a comment. What is your take? Holy, he's climbing up, Herman? There are Insane. a number of unexplained things caught on camera in the sky. Uh, I think we're gonna see a UFO, boys. Is that what's happening? Oh, is that the thing? In this next yeah, this video, one? a dragon-like creature can be seen lurking the horizon. Wait, what? Okay, dragon-like creature caught on camera, Himalayas? Yeah. Where, where? I don't see it. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's just a glimpse. It's very difficult to say exactly what creature this is, but at a certain moment in the video, you can see the creature flapping its wings. What should you think? It cannot be a plane, right? Because I feel like that this was bigger. 
A plane would have been smaller from that distance. The plane would look smaller from that distance, I think. Yeah, I don't know. Can it be like balloon, like blimp? Mm, Bruh. I don't think so. Like, I I'm, I'm not sure about the routes. I've never been on a blimp ever. Uh, and, you know, I played GTA, so that's the only reason I know about a blimp. Uh, air balloon, right? Uh, I don't think they would fly an air balloon over Himalayas mountain. Yeah, right? It is huge. This happened in the border between China and India, if I'm not mistaken, and this video was posted a couple of years ago. Okay. Have you ever seen a creature that wasn't supposed to be there? Okay, so man is running from... Talking about things that aren't what? supposed to be there. Yo! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yo! Almost as though, like, a human-sized mosquito was following him. Francisco Hernandez was a patrolman for an airplane in Mexico City a couple of years ago and he was oh, doing really? what he was supposed to do. Yeah. He was checking the airplane to see if there was nothing wrong with it when he heard strange sounds coming from the inside. So oh, he did what he had to do, he checked one of the compartments where the noises were coming from. Oh rip, oh rip. You can oh, see him doing this with caution. He checks every corner of the area and he sees nothing, there's nothing there. Or so he thinks. What's gonna happen? What's when gonna he happen? was backing away from this area, he heard the noise again, and this is what he saw. Yeah, 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 yeah. Verga. Oh, rip, oh, rip. Pay oh, very rip. much attention to the end of the corridor. This is exactly where he was a couple of minutes ago, checking it out. Okay. Yeah. Oh, rip. Oh, what? Yo, I saw something. I saw something. It moved his head. No mommies. Yeah, no mommies. Right, right. No mommies. No mommies. Yeah, what does no mommies mean? I believe it's Spanish, right? Yeah, that plane. Damn, that plane was possessed though. Would you even fly that plane though, right? Like, holy, crazy man. Holy. No mommies. No, no, no. Posted by El Mayanero. On May 17, 2020, an unexplained and strange phenomena is seen on Mexican skies. Check this out. Yeah, Mexicans be like... No, Barry, it's the sky. Look, it's the sky solo. Mira, 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 probably. Yo, I, I watched Scooby-Doo as a, as a kid, so there's like... Uh, you know, in Scooby-Doo, there was like... They they made like cartoon movie on like Mexican coast. I forgot the name. Chupacabra? Yeah, I think it's the Chupacabra. It's the Chupacabra! It's the Chupacabra! That's the only Mexican coast I know. Uh oh. Or the people who are the paranormal it take their time to discuss if this is a storm coming or if it is something else. It's the aliens. It's the aliens. They are here! They are lock yourselves in the basement, brothers. The Martians if are here! If this were to be by any chance a normal storm, I don't think that these people would be as baffled as they were. And I've never seen anything like this myself. If you observe, there is a lot of wind, which makes me think, yes, there might be a storm coming. But what about these strange blinking lights in the sky? What's doing that? I hear absolutely no thunder at all, and not only that, check this moment in the video where the light actually- uh, I've actually seen like stuff happen where- but it would be very very clear, like in the, in the sky I would see like lightning. Uh, it would make it very clear, it would make itself very clear that it's lightning and not something like this. And, and I wouldn't hear any sound, so that tells me that there was light- there were lightning strikes, but probably like very far away to the point where- uh, I was not making noise, uh, so I think that's what it is. But this has like orange uh, color to it, look to it, so it doesn't look like lightning. Actually, stays on. <laughs> yeah, it feels something different, no. or maybe light hitting from the ground up on the clouds. It's probably something else, or or something else. Yeah. Whatever that is, it's so high. Right, right That's here. Look, there's another one. Way too. This one is coming from Logan Paul. Oh my God! So Logan Paul spotted some the UFO, the aliens. Lock yourselves in the basement. The Martians are here. Fast roll. Oh, it's moving. Oh! 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 Now this is not the only unexplained oh phenomenon God. that was Dang. recorded on camera this year. The aliens knew that Logan Paul was recording, so that's why it gave it gave him the signal. 
YouTuber Logan Paul with his crew caught this very strange object in the sky and it is as if it knew they were pointing at it. Yeah, right? At first I thought this video was fake until I saw this one posted by Junior Flores LG Barito on Facebook. Check this out. Oh, okay, it looks like a parachute. It Okay, so it's the same video that the same video that Logan Paul but from somebody else's perspective and point of view and they were just somewhere di okay if that's the same video damn okay holy I mean two different angles two different people capturing it I just emptied out my entire mag. That's a lot of lights. It's as right if there. there is some sort of party going on up there and we're not invited. <laughs> For example, check yeah. this video coming in from Ana Sofia Valencia on Facebook. This happened in Spain. <laughs> okay, I don't know what he's saying, but... As you can see in this video, the but light seems to be coming from above the clouds. Meaning, this is not some sort of light source on Earth that is reflecting above. Whatever is going on here, it's pretty much unexplained. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, so it's like actually lighting up. This is, uh, it looks big as well. Uh, you got like smaller lights here, 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 and you got like a big ass light in the middle. Is it moving? And if you've ever seen anything like this before, please do share it with us under the comment. Reddit user finds a fake rock in the middle of the desert producing a beeping sound. Must be a government <laughs> spy cam or something or their device. Inception. I just thought Whatever that Whatever is going there on up the in spot the clouds might be something we else. We could say it's some sort of glitch or in the matrix, be. maybe. I'm not too sure. Do you think, okay, so that thought that I just gave, like, hey, holy shit, right? Like, can't be a government spy or something. It might actually be. What do you think that could be then? You know, fake. Uh, or maybe it's like, maybe it's the alien spy. Maybe it's just the aliens that left those uh, fake rocks with cameras inside them on the on our planet. Maybe that's it's what 10, it is. 10.15 at night in Maple Grove, Minnesota. I think these are not delusive clouds. I've never seen them before. Look how bright they are. It's amazing. This is on the northern horizon. Yeah, they look weirdly different. Incredible. Yeah, right. Uh, yeah, the sun is setting as well, so... But, but I've never seen a pattern like that. Talking about glitches in the Matrix, Raul Argello, 32 years old, captured a very strange anomaly investigating oh, right. Thomas Adolfo Ducos. Oh man, man is about to go underground, he about to go in his basement, he about to catch some weird stuff, man. Stadium in Buenos Aires, Argentina. This happened a couple of years ago when he was doing his normal checkup on the place. Okay. It's all. He's saying this has never happened to him before. And as you can see, he's pretty much frightened by it because there's supposed to be no one in the stadium at this time of night. Yeah. Oh, dang. Hands up in the air. Yeah. Yeah, the video is On so a loud, very bro. brave move, he goes in the room to see nothing. There is nothing, nothing there. Clear, clear, he clear. He mentions that this is the third time this day yeah, 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 yeah. This happens, and there is no one there. However, if we roll back a couple of seconds from this moment, we can see a black shadow crossing him. He didn't even see this happening, but the camera captured it. How creepy is this? Yeah, that's the shadow. Somebody was there, huh? Like, for real? 
What? In the f Yeah, the stomach bloating sound, right? Stomach uh, sound when the... Uh, probably hungry, probably hungry. You need to put another disc inside, so... Bruh. Let it play, man. Or maybe the motors are just... What the f***? No, I'm a maybe really big fan of music and radio stations. I really enjoy spending my time trying to find different topics and music out there. Okay. But in this case, a subscriber sent us a very strange video Yo. of a bizarre... Yo, oh, shit. Oh, shit. almost looking like in the Illuminati eye, right? Holy, god damn, yeah, look at that, that's like the, the eye, crazy man. Hard noise that was being emitted by a radio station, and she was able to capture this in different times of day, different radio stations, and different radio device, which makes this all very, very creepy. Like for real? What? You need to throw that second out right now, bro. In the immediately, you gotta throw that out immediately, dog. What the? Are you kidding me? What the hell? It's probably broken or possessed. Oh my God. That is not right. And this one <laughs> is at night time in possessed. another room. Oh, rip. Yo, all of the sudden video got very loud. Oh shit! So the same video, same guy or different? So it's like the same that we just saw or a different device? Different guy, different device, or same? Nah, no, different, different. Nah, no, same, 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 I think it's same. What? It could be same. And when you get near it start. Sort of interference or something else. Has anything like ever happened to you? It's the aliens, it's the Martians, it's the aliens. Vous avez vu un truc encore, oh my god. No, bro, je veux pas aller là. Le gars en train de parler français, puis tu vois les yeux, or I should speak English here. You see the eyes here, right? For a second, I forgot Bruh. that this was an English video. No, I'm not only a big fan of music and radio stations, I'm also a very big fan of nature and going outside. Okay. Yeah, we love, we see that you love to in touch this grass. Video, a group of friends is having a really good time in the woods in France until they spot something really strange behind one of the trees. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I remember, I remember seeing this clip. I remember seeing this clip, though. Now, I'm not too sure if this group of people actually saw this bizarre looking creature. One of the boys approaches the trees, and this is when you can actually see that there's something there. Yeah, it's video like a, ends too soon. Damn, it looks like an like dead ass like an alien. And there's not a way for us to know what happened next. My guess is that they actually saw whatever was there and started running. Yeah. Damn, it looks like an alien. Oh, holy. Now I'm also a fan of sports. In a video titled Eddie Guerrero Hall of My guy fan of everybody. Eddie Guerrero? Oh my god, yo, I used to watch WWE back in the days. He passed away, right? I think he killed himself, if I'm not mistaken. Hall of Fame Induction Part 2, you can supposedly see Rey Mysterio shape-shifting. What? Now, I'm pretty sure this is because of the camera quality that is very bad, and because the pixels are distorted. Nevertheless, this is a very intriguing video. What do you think? Okay, run that back, run that back, run that back. Nevertheless, this is camera quality that is very bad, and because the pixels are distorted. Nevertheless, this is a very intriguing video. What do you think? I see nothing. Well, this is it for honest. now, folks. We I see nothing, but guys, click on this video on the screen. This is the last episode that we've done on it. You're gonna love it, man. Check it out, and I'll see you right there.